Hey, welcome to Tuesday Talk. This is going to be our continuation on series on breast implants. I'm going to talk specifically about saline implants. What are the advantages of saline implants? Well, the two main advantages are number one, cost, and number two, decreased risk of capsular contracture. A pair of saline implants is about $900 per pair cheaper than silicone implants. The risk of capsular contracture is less than silicone implants, and that's whether the implant is above the muscle or below the muscle. Now, there are some downsides to saline implants. The biggest downside is the way it feels. It's not the same feel as native breast tissue. It doesn't feel as close to breast tissue as a silicone implant. The failure rate with a saline implant is also higher. It's about 7% when you compare it to a silicone implant that's about 2%. Now, one advantage is what happens if it does rupture. If a saline implant ruptures, you will know it. It won't be subtle, the breast will deflate. The silicone implant, if it ruptures, you may not know about it or may not know about it right away. Okay. And then lastly, one downside of a saline implant is it may show rippling along the sides of the breast, which you generally don't see with silicone implants.